Hello children. Let us today discuss fuels and fuel efficiency. What are fuels? Fuels are the substances that are sources of heat and light energy or which on burning give off heat and light as energy. Some of the examples of fuels are wood, charcoal, petrol, diesel, kerosene, LPG, natural gas, etc. Let us now find out what the qualities of good fuel are. A good fuel is low in cost, is readily available, is easy to store and transport, has high calorific value, and does not emit poisonous substances or polluting substances to the environment. What is the calorific value of a fuel? The calorific value of a fuel is the amount of energy that is released when 1 kg of fuel is burned. It is the characteristic of a fuel. The unit of calorific value of a fuel is kilojoule per kg. Now let us see the calorific value in kilojoule per kg of certain fuels. The calorific value of hydrogen is 1,50,000 kilojoule per kg. The calorific value of LPG is 55,000 kilojoule per kg. The calorific value of biogas is 40,000 kilojoule per kg. The calorific value of coal is 30,000 kilojoule per kg. The calorific value of the wood is 18,000 kilojoule per kg. The calorific value of redwood charcoal is 28,350 kilojoule per kg. The calorific value of diesel is 45,000 per kg. The calorific value of methane is 50,000 kilojoule per kg. The calorific value of CNG is 50,000 kilojoule per kg. Now, let us learn what the three important conditions for the combustion of a fuel to occur are. However, before that, we must acquaint ourselves with the term ignition temperature. What is ignition temperature? Ignition temperature is the lowest temperature at which fuel ignites and starts to burn. Now let us learn three important conditions for the combustion to occur. The first is that the substance should be combustible. The second condition is that the environment must support combustion. This refers to the presence of oxygen. The third condition for combustion is the attainment of the ignition temperature. Most of the fuels are hydrocarbons. So let us now see the general equation of the burning of hydrocarbon in oxygen. CXHY is the general formula of a hydrocarbon. Thus in the general equation of burning of hydrocarbon in oxygen. CXHY reacts with X plus Y by 4 of oxygen to give X carbon dioxide and Y by 2 H2O along with the evolution of lot of heat and light energy. Now let us see the harmful effects of combustion. Carbon fuels like wood, diesel, petroleum release unburned carbon particles. These particles are dangerous pollutants that can cause respiratory diseases like asthma. In the cases of incomplete combustion, carbon monoxide gas is released. Well, carbon monoxide gas is highly poisonous in nature. Most of the fuels release carbon dioxide in combustion. The increased concentration of carbon dioxide in the air causes global warming. Burning of the coal, diesel, releases sulfur dioxide gas. Sulfur dioxide is an extremely suffocating and corrosive gas. The oxides of sulfur and nitrogen get dissolved in rainwater and form acids. Such rain is called acid rain. Let us summarize. Fuel. 
the substances which are the sources of heat and light energy, all which, on burning, give off heat and light as the energy. They are usually alkanes. Qualities of a good fuel Low cost, readily available, easy to store and transport, high calorific value, no emission of poisonous substances or polluting substances to the environment. Calorific value of fuel. It is the amount of energy that is released when 1 kilogram of fuel is burnt. Ignition temperature. The lowest temperature at which fuel ignites and starts burning. 1. The substance should be combustible. 2. The environment must support combustion, presence of air or O2. 3. Attainment of the ignition temperature.